this is a new Tronsmart Mega Pro Bluetooth speaker. It has a simple modern design, it has a decent power of 60 watts and some nice extra feature which makes this speaker really great. However, how good is the sound quality, how long does the battery last and is it better compared to the similar price Tronsmart T6 Max? Well, let's figure it out in this video review. Hey, what is up guys, Nellis here from Nuxtech team and welcome everyone to my first video review of 2021. I hope you are all doing well and now, without further ado, let's jump into it. Inside of my box you will find a speaker, a warranty card, informational card, a manual book, USB Type-C and a 3.5mm audio cable. Transform Mega Pro has a really solid build quality and it weighs around 1.8 kg. It's not the most compact Bluetooth speaker in the market, but considering its size, it has quite a lot of power and a decent 10400 mAh battery. On the back of the speaker you'll find a physical power button and some ports including USB-C charging port, a regular USB which can be used to charge your phone, micro SD card slot, which to be honest I'm not sure if somebody still use and a 3.5mm audio jack if you prefer a wire connection. Now on the top you'll find the main control panel with a variety of sensor buttons including the play, pause, skip forward, activate voice assistant and change the equalizer mode. Add to this you can also volume up or down simply by tapping on the respective buttons or by sliding from one to another side. Although I'm personally not the biggest fan of sensor controls in general and I would prefer physical ones, let's also face the truth that you will most likely control everything from your smartphone. Connecting your phone to the speaker over Bluetooth 5.0 is pretty simple and straightforward. For more convenience you can also use NFC for pairing or unpairing process and it works great just as expected. Alright, I think it's just the right time to do some real life tests and comparison between Tronsmart Mega Pro and Tronsmart T6 Max. In my opinion, both speakers deliver a really good sound quality for the price. T6 Max seems to be a bit louder and more punchy overall, meanwhile Transform Mega Pro has more clear vocals which is great for listening to podcasts. You should also take a note that sound distribution also differs. T6 Max can offer you a 360 degree sound experience and the newest Mega Pro model is simply one directional. There are three different equalizer modes you can directly switch by pressing the mode button. The deep bass, which is actually not as deep as on T6 Max, is set by default, but you can change to vocal or 3D mode. <laughs> Personally, I just keep it on default and that, in my opinion, sounds the best. 
If you want some extra adjustments, you can also use some third-party equalizer apps on your phone, but for average user it will be just fine out of the box. I haven't noticed any kind of problems with Bluetooth wireless connection. During all that period I have tested T6 Max and Mega Pro, both speakers did a really good job in keeping connection stable, no dropouts or random disconnections at all. So that's great. Now speaking of a battery, I found out that Tron Smart Mega Pro can last around 8 to 10 hours on 50% volume level while the T6 Max is a bit behind with an average time of 6 to 7 hours. What I really don't like on my T6 Max is that after the low battery notification sound, speaker literally turns off within 3 minutes. I mean, who does that? If you hear a low battery sound, well, I would expect at least 30 minutes of playtime till the battery dies. Thankfully, with a Transmart Mega Pro, it's all done properly. When the battery reaches 20% level, you will hear a sound signal and you will be still able to use the speaker for around 45 minutes. My only complaint regarding Mega Pro Bluetooth speaker is actually the backlight LED touch panel. While the response to the touches is quite ok and accurate, I was a bit disappointed that you cannot turn off a backlight LED. Of course, it's not a deal breaker, not at all. But at some moments I felt like it would be better if it was off and at the same time it could save some battery, right? So what are my final thoughts and which speaker I would recommend for you? Well, for me personally, Transmart T6 Max seems to be a better option due to the more balanced overall sound quality, more powerful bass and I also like this Apple HomePod style design that gives a 360 degree sound. This speaker is great for music background or even for watching some movies. If you want to see my full review of T6 Max, you can simply click on our info card on the top right corner. However, Transmart Mega Pro is not that far away considering sound quality and it also has its own advantages. It has a longer lasting battery, ability to play music directly from micro SD card, it can be used as a power bank to charge your devices and this might be really handy on your trips. Honestly, I found out myself enjoying listening to podcasts more with Mega Pro rather than T6 Max because T6 Max bass sometimes feels like too much. All things considered, both speakers right now can be found somewhere around 80 US dollars and well, they really deliver more than expected. As always, I will leave all the links to the best discount codes in the description area below this video, so definitely don't forget to check them out. And that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did, please hit that thumbs up and subscribe buttons. Don't forget to click on the notification bell icon to stay updated with my latest video reviews. Thanks for watching. This is Nellis from Nukes Tech and I'll see you next time.